if you are going to build first machine learning model then this video is perfectly fine for you as you know the behind the machine learning model everything is the mathematics so your data set must be in the numeric format otherwise your machine learning algorithm cannot understand those things right so if your data set are in string or the categorical format then you have to convert those data into the numeric format so your machine learning algorithm can understand and build the model over there right so how you will convert those categorical data or the ordinal data string data into the machine learning format or the numeric format for that i am going to explain three important concept that is in the um, uh, spark python py spark first one is the string indexer second is the one hot encoder and third is the vector assembler all three are very important concept when you do any machine learning model development this concept will be definitely you have to use that so let us start the discussion over there so suppose if we have one data frame first column is the id and second column is some category of data for make the example easy i have taken some fruits name so this is our data set now we have to convert this categorical data into numerical form so what we will do we will use the string indexer concept okay what it will do i have to pass this data frame into this api it will convert apple to zero guava to one banana two on which basis on the basis of the frequency so if you see we have the apple maximum time we have the apple so that's why its frequency is the lowest frequency put the zero after that we have guava two times in the descending order so guava is one and banana has the one so we have given the two it use the frequency descending order if you want to do opposite no i want to give the maximum frequency who come the maximum means ascending then you can pass this parameter so i am going to take you the code walk through also so i will explain everything in the code also i will show the both example right so what it will do it will convert so now instead of the apple i will get the zero so now you can see the id zero apple so in apple it become the one right banana it become the two because banana is the two so banana is become the two then again guava guava become one right now we have the again apple so put the zero again apple zero and guava one okay so we have already transferred the uh, this uh, categorical data into the numeric but now we come into the different issues problem why it means if you are giving to zero to apple and two to banana means is banana greater than apple does it make any sense or guava is better than apple no sense right so this number does not suit here right or the value of banana is more than the value of apple the price of banana is more than the guava no these are the categorical data all data are same right so how the machine learning algorithm take care so to solve this problem we have to come across new concept that is the one hot encoder in short you is to say ho hachi right how it works now so it will convert this individual data into the list what it will do now is this three data come here and see it will convert into the array and they will put the apple guava and banana right and index of if this is the array index of apple is zero guava index one and banana apple two 
right now if you want to represent the apple so what is the index of apple zero so at the position of zero you put just one one means present zero means absent so one means apple present banana and guava and banana is absent second we have banana right for the banana what is index two so at the position of two put the one so position of two i put the one so id one is the banana and this is zero the same way we have the guava right what is guava position one so put the one at the index of one easy so the same way we can do that so we convert this number into the one uh, array or the vector right this is the general concept for the one uh, hot encoder how it work in the spark one hot encoder estimator this is the little bit advanced of the general concept so in one hot encoder estimator what we do we take the three information for the any size of this so first indicate this first data indicate the number of category so we have the three category right apple guava and banana so put the three so three is the common last column it shows it is present or absent so it always one if you take the bigger example value might be changed but in this case this is always one means it is present now what is present that we present here so this value is represent the actual categorical value so now we have to show the apple right we have to show the apple here what we will do apple index is zero right so put the zero i have already explained apple index is zero so this is the zero so three is the size one shows the present this middle value shows the index of that category second case is banana for banana we have two for guava we have two apple again apple and the guava so this is the uh called the one hot one hot encoder estimator okay now with a bit more advance i can reduce the one size also how don't consider the last one so if you have the n category only consider the n minus 1 so it will save some uh, uh, your stories how i am going to show so how many category we have three category i will not consider the last one we will consider the except the last one so the two so now the size is two okay this part is as it is what we have zero and one now the second part is banana and banana is the last index we are dropping out we are dropping out the last index you are not going to consider last index so in place of banana we are not passing anything see so it will indicate if this is empty means this is the last index last index is the banana okay otherwise everything the same third one is the guava right guava also here one one it is also one one so instead of the three we have taken the so this concept is called the one hard encoder estimator but drop last is equal to two you have to set so i will show the both the uh, code so and the last concept for this video is the vector assembler what is this so suppose if you have one data set if you have one data set id mobile hours user data and click somehow some use case and you have this data as we know these are the our feature column right in the machine learning terminology and this is the target column we will take all this feature data and make into one column means single vector column with the help of vector assembler so now i create one new column it will combined 
of the feature column. So, 1, 18, 1, 1.56, 1.18, 1.56, same way. And now this data is final data set that if you go to our machine learning algorithm. So, let us start the uh, uh, code walk. I will show all the code work. Okay. So, uh, I am going to show in the next video. So, please continue the next video. I will explain everything through the code for your better understanding. Okay. Let us start the code.